photography is not on sale. Nothing's on sale. You can't find it anywhere. Only at conventions, unless eBay and whatever. And it's awesome. This cost me five dollars. It's Shadow of the Colossus done like in pencil, but all rendered on the computer. Uh, I have two more up in there. That's Bioshock and Assassin's Creed. Assassin's Creed, that cannot be found anywhere online. I checked Google, I checked her site, she doesn't show it. That cost me $5. I'm, I asked her autograph it, miss, please. Like, what you just showed me was beyond beautiful. Also, for speaking of freebies, yeah, guys, uh, no big deal, but I got it for free. It's Fable 3. It was, it was free a couple days ago. I really don't care about the game. It, I just opened it. If you want the game and willing to give me 60 bucks for a brand new game, then whatever. Uh, all 3B games. If you went to Xbox One, took a picture with either one of these. I was slender, as I told you. So you have Rise. Or, it was Rise again, but that's me. Or, uh, Dead... Dead Rising 3, you'd get, you go to EB Games, they would sign it for you, and wham, bam, thank you, jam. Three months free. I got, I got, I did four of them. I got a full year free, thanks to Microsoft, so I'm going to thank Microsoft personally, and EB Games personally, for doing this. It was an amazing honor for them to actually give, away, give stuff away. I couldn't believe that, I couldn't believe that I actually got this. And guys, if you think of not going to conventions, do go to them because you, even though you might think you spend a lot of money, if you're a toy collector, yes, you're spending a lot of money. But if you're into games, you're going to get a lot of free stuff. You're going to get more free stuff than you're going to spend. Trust me. I got two comic books. Uh, I don't care if you guys want to look at if you got. I don't think you guys will be interested. But if for those people who are interested in comic books, they're called... Grim Myth Tales, Le Myth and Legends. Um, no, I did not get it for the girls. Beauty and the Beast and Little Red Riding Hood. It's about... It's like in present day, so... It's a uh, more modern feel, and they made it more darker, so... You actually see... If some Say like Beauty and the Beast, if like Beast is killing someone, you see intestines being... Intestines being ripped out and all this stuff, so... Like that stuff... Like action catches my interest, so of course... And they were 10 bucks, and they go on retail for $16. Plus tax, that'll be $18. I saved 8 bucks on this. I don't mind. I'm happy. Are you happy? <gasps> Me having the time of my life at Fan Expo, Dead Rising 3. You need a zombie hunter? Call me maybe, guys. Because I know how, like, ka -ching, ka -ching, ka -ching, in the neck. Even though it's attacking the brain, I'm not stupid. I'm just... Giving you pointers. Uh, there's a couple more stuff I want to show you. More stuff I got for free because of EB Game. Huzzah. It's a patch you iron on. It's, look, guys, I'm part of Call of Duty Black Ops. Yeah, I'm cool. Uh, PS4 lights. Playing the scratch one from PS4. It's actually pretty damn bright, as you can see. I mean, look in my nose. I'm sorry you had to see that. Mortal Kombat, because uh, Warner Brothers was there. And they were doing uh, Arkham, or Arkham Origins. So, of course, they're giving away... Uh, Mortal Kombat keychain. Look, show them. There you go, Mortal Kombat. It's usually like $3. I got it for free. Uh, Bioshock pins, Assassin's Creed 3 pins. So let's do this fast. So Bioshock, uh, Assassin's Creed 3, and Elizabeth from Bioshock. Okay, so there's a couple more things I want to do. Dark Horse, uh, comics, art books. They made Last of Us art book, Bioshock, Zelda. They're amazing. Uh, how it was done. It's not, they didn't create it, it was how the comics were, the hardcover, how it looks. Like, they know how to make the product placement actually work for things. So they made uh, a comic for Last of Us. If you didn't get the collector's edition, then you wouldn't have known. But if you did, you'd get one of the, one out of four issues created. And Dark Horse was there. I come on the first day, they are sold out of episode two and three. Issue two and three. Last issue of number four, American Dreams, that's L, that's, uh, Sorry, Ellie, and that's Riley, Ellie's best friend. If you've ever played the game, um, they were friends together, and then you learn what happens during the game. Uh, I found this for ten dollars. If you guys have seen this around, I was inspired. I was like inspired to buy it. And the red lights from my microphone. Sorry about that. So yeah, that's that cost me ten dollars, more than I expected. 
like not price wise. I'm not saying like it was expensive. Like it was a really good price for something I expected to be like 15 since how popular it is. Now these two pictures, you're gonna be like, oh my god, that's a lot. Yes, it is, but for the design of them, I think it was worth it. So we're gonna start with Halo because you guys are 360 fans, and nobody under. And I don't think anyone has played PS2 that much. Like it's older. I'm I'm 19. I'm going. I'm turning 20 next year. Um, so I don't think many of my fans have played it. But if you have, that's good. That's a good job. If you haven't, get on your 360 or PS3. Metal Gear Solid 2, 3, and Peace Walker. And Metal Gear Solid 5 also, because 4 is only PS3 exclusive. So we're gonna start off with. Uh, one with Halo and Cortana looking at each other opposite angles. So that's how it looks like. I got the signature in the top. Uh, wait, right there. I got the signature right there. I can't tell because I'm looking at my other screen. Uh, but yeah, this looked really cool. You put it any way you want. It has to be like this. Or it could be like this, how it is. And then Metal Gear Solid 2, if everyone remembers this part when you're facing Metal Gear Rex, or Metal Gear Solid 1, a uh, Solid Snake with the silence, tranquilizer gun, MK14 or whatever it's called. But yeah guys, that's all I got from Fan Expo, I know, not much, but I just, most of it was free. So yeah, think about that, some of the, I didn't get much, I got a thing from Veronica Taylor, um, um, autograph, and I took a picture with her for my sister, of course. Call of Duty Ghosts, I promise to do another Road to Commander, sniping only. It might take me a while, but I'll do it. I'll finish my uh, Race to Division 1, or Ultimate, uh, on my way to Division 1. I don't want to say race. Uh, then I got a message saying, please do a career mode. So if you guys want that, please say it in the comments. If you want to see more of this beautiful face. If you're at Fan Expo, please tell me. It'll be really honored um, to see like actual people from Toronto and Vaughn or anywhere in Ontario or the world saying that they're that watching my videos and came with to Fan Expo and I hope that you saw me there. It's it was such a great weekend guys. And if you were there, I'm I hope you I think you guys know what I'm talking about. If you didn't see any of these panels, it was Artist Gallery, E B Games, Xbox, Ubisoft, PlayStation, uh, Warner Brothers, and then all in the middle. Like in the middle where the toys are and the shirts and whatever or not so anyway this has been acas 13 i will see you guys i'll make a video i'll make a couple more videos right now but they'll be issued they'll issued look they'll be made uh later on so hope you guys enjoy this uh comment rate subscribe as you usually do and i will see you soon